Hello YouTube, today I'm going to be showing you one hour of crafting nature runes. This isn't really a guide, but I'm just demonstrating you this anyways. You'll need Wicked Hood teleport tokens, which are from Treasure Hunter, or Nature Altar tablets. The reason I wanted to test this was because nature runes were kind of overpriced, so I wanted to see how good the profit per hour was. In my inventory, I use one of each pouch size. Small which holds 3, medium which holds 6, large which holds 9, giant which holds 12, and massive which holds 18 essences. The rest of them are just pure essences. For those who are curious what I'm wearing, it is an Infinity Ethereal outfit, which is a runecrafting outfit from Treasure Hunter. The nice thing about this is it can store up to 12 pure essences. Tacos though is for bank teleporting. It's actually faster than max guild teleport. Don't worry about the rest of my equipment since I use them for abyss runecrafting anyways. I also have an abyssal titan which requires 93 summoning and holds up to 20 pure essences. So pretty much each trip I use 103 essences. Since I completed the hero's welcome quest, I can craft an additional 5% more runes. That being said, I can craft 216 runes per perfect trip, although I do sometimes misclick and I do end up not filling one of my pouches. The way I fill my pouches quickly each trip is I line them up from top to bottom at the bank interface. Then I right click fill from the top pouch all the way down to the bottom. What happens is that it fills the pouch from the bank. I also keep my equipment interface open from the bank because that way I can fill my ethereal outfit by right clicking the body. To toggle to open the equipment interface in the bank every time, simply click the equipment icon on the top right corner of the bank interface. After you fill the ethereal body, it will close the bank. Then I open the bank again and I hit my preset key to load the full preset. Pretty much now I keep on my wicked hood, or the ethereal head rather, and hit the key to open the wicked hood interface. Then I click the nature rune icon and hit teleports, and then it will teleport me outside the nature altar. So every 30 teleports, you need to refill your wicked hood with tokens. So essentially each teleport token is worth 3 teleports. They're fairly uncommon to win from Treasure Hunter. So if you get a few of these, I suggest you stockpile them. For max players like me, you can win around 7 of them at a time. Pretty simple method, but is this worth doing? I would say it's extremely worth doing. I mean, efficient minded people would have done the abyss, or even saved up their money for keys, for you know, smoldering lamps and stars. But honestly, I find this insanely profitable, and the XP per hour isn't that bad. Alright, so in one hour I was able to get 145k XP. I've used 50 tokens, crafting 32k nature runes. From what I price checked at the time of recording this video, it was 404 GP each. Right now at the time of the upload, it's around 371 GP. That means it's still around 12 mil per hour. I would say if you use your daily Wicked Hood tokens, go for nature runes as they're the most profit per teleport. So yeah, thanks for watching and I hope it helps. If I missed anything, feel free to ask.